Jennifer, have you trusted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? Yes, I have. Based on your profession of faith, it's my honor to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Savior, based on your profession of faith, it's my pleasure to baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. cannonball into this thing. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Here, why don't you turn this way? Oh, there's... There it is. <laughs> Mike, have you trusted Jesus as your Lord and Savior? No, I have. I know you have. <laughs> Based on your profession of faith, it's my pleasure to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> Next we have Abby. Abby, have you trusted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. That's awesome. We celebrate that with you. It's my joy to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Next we have Bay. Let's welcome her on up. <laughs> hey, it's so so exciting how God has worked in your life over the last year to bring you to Him and to, to see the change in your life. It's really incredible. So way to go on trusting Jesus. Have you trusted Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. Awesome. And I, it's my joy to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Next we have Jesse. <laughs> Jesse, my friend, it has been such a joy to see God at work in your life this summer, to see your heart to be a leader and a servant. So Jesse, have you trusted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. Awesome. It's my joy to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Next up, we have Jane, who's going to get to baptize Lauren and Margo, where Jane has played a special part in their lives and stories. So we're so excited for Jane to get to baptize uh, these ladies. Come on up here. Yeah, Lauren and Jane! <laughs> Have you accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Yes. It is my honor to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yeah, Margo! Whoa. 
Margaret, have you accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Yes, I have. And it is my honor to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Next, we have my new favorite Benting, Tyson. <laughs> Sorry, Whitney. Tyson, you confess that you have put your trust in Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior of your life? Yes. Well then, upon profession of your faith, it's my privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Kate, I'm, I'm, I think I know the answer to this based off your testimony earlier, but you declare before everyone here that you have trusted in Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior of your life? Yes. That upon profession of your faith, it is my pleasure to baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Now we have Audrey. <laughs> Audrey, have you have you have you professed your faith in Lord in Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior of your life? Yes. Then, upon profession of your faith, it's my privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. But certainly not least, now we have Miriam Tron coming in. <laughs> Miriam, if you put your trust in Jesus as Lord and Savior of your life, yeah. then it's my privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. and getting to celebrate with our brothers and sisters in Christ who have uh, made this momentous decision today. Like we said, if you have not been baptized but have put your trust in Jesus, we really encourage you to look out for the next baptism event because we'd love to be able to celebrate with you. If you haven't put your trust in Jesus before, please come and talk to one of us. We'd love to uh, just have a conversation with you and, and talk to you uh, about it more. So thanks for coming out. You're free to hang out and... and Spend time with each other. We can do our like post tailgate now. Maybe. I don't know, but uh, you're also free to, to head out if, if you'd like. So thanks again for coming. Yay.